woke up quick at about noon Just thought that I had to be in Compton soon I gotta get drunk before the day begins Before my mother starts bitching about my friends About to go and damn near went blind Young niggas at the pad throwing up gang signs What's up everybody? So now we're back to the second review for R&L Peruvian Body Wave Hair. If you haven't seen my last video on this hair, please go and check that out for more information about the company and its hair. So I have finally installed it in my head and I am going to tell you what I think about it. I've been wearing it for a few days because I wanted to see how it was going to go first before I actually did another video on it. Okay, so after I received the hair that I showed you guys from my previous video, I went ahead and washed it and let it air dry. So, the only thing that I can say about when I washed it is that it might have a little bit of hair dye in it because I saw some in the sink. I don't know if it was just extremely dirty or it was actually hair dye, but I'm assuming it was hair dye. So, the foam of the shampoo was a little dark, so that's why I'm assuming it might have been a hair dye. But, anywho... Also, after I washed it, I noticed that it lightened up a little bit, so now it's like a natural brown hair color, which I really like because it blends in with my natural hair a lot easier, and it looks more natural anyway. So, that's the only thing I really have about the hair, that it had a little dye in it, which is not a big deal. Um, like I said, it didn't have any odor in this hair, and I've been wearing it for a few days. It has not tangled on me at all. It still hasn't shed, and the oh, it's actually, y'all, let me tell you this, so it's body wave that I told you guys. It's a 20 inch, a 18 inch, and a 16 inch bundle. I don't have a closure out. This is just a U-part wig and I just left my hair out at the top. So one thing that I was really, really excited about this hair, y'all, was that the fact that I could flat iron it like bone straight. I was too happy about that because I do like to wear my hair straight a lot. And a lot of companies have been sending me in body wave hair. So I was really happy that I could flat iron this hair really, really straight. And also, the ends are now really soft. Just did a little washing and a little bit of conditioner. And I knew it was going to come out soft. Because I know when I first got the package, it was a little rough. But now it's not rough anymore. So I'm happy about that. So after I flat ironed it, I curled it like this. And it only took me like a few minutes to curl it. I didn't even do anything too long or too crazy. It curled really easily and I've been wearing it curled anyway so it's been holding the curl very well. So I'm excited about that that it can flat out easily and then it can hold the curl as good. So it, it has been holding up very very well. So like I'm going to let you guys see my fingers go through the curls. The hair is really soft. And this is three bundles. Like I have a little bit of hair left. I maybe have about that much hair. So I mean it's still a nice little amount but I didn't put it in. So it looks very natural as well. I've been getting compliments on this hair day. It looks natural because it's not like super thick or anything. So I noticed like whenever I let it air dry, it was a whole lot thicker. But when you flat iron it, it's just going to simmer down a little bit. But you can still have that full look by letting it air dry after you wash it. And you'll still have like that loose body weight pattern. So like I said, this is the body weight Peruvian. I'll be wearing this hair a lot. Like, even for my birthday, I'm going to wear this hair. But I think I'm going to add, like, some more hair that I have around the house and add to this for my birthday. And then I'm thinking about coloring it a brown color. What you guys think? Like, let me know below if you think I should color my hair like a brownish tint or something. Not like brown brown, but just like a like a, a natural brown. But not like this natural brown, but you know what I'm trying to say. Like a brown, yeah. Yeah, let me know how you think that a brown color will look on me. Because I need to hair because my birthday is in two weeks and I need to hair up. Get on the ball. Anyway, so yeah, I don't have any complaints about this hair. Only because I've been wearing it for the past few days just to test it out. Haven't had any shedding. Haven't had any um, tangling. Haven't had any issues like that. It feels really soft to the touch all the way down to the bottom. Of, well, all the way to the ends of the hair. So, and as you see, my fingers go through it, and we're going to go ahead and see if any shedding has happened since. Okay, so how many? We got one strand, but when I did that, one long strand. So, I'm going to go ahead and do this side. Okay, so I have more on this side. Let's see how many strands. Oh, Lord. Okay, one, two three so we had three strands to come off on this side which is pretty decent so 
So yeah, guys, let me know what you think about this hair. Like I said, this is from R&L Company. I will leave all their information, of course, in my description. And I'm going to go ahead and leave the direct link to this hair as well because you guys be asking about, like, what's the direct link to the hair. So they did provide that, and I'm going to also put it in the description. So make sure you guys go and purchase your hair from them and check them out. And also follow me on my Instagram page. And also, if you need, my friend keeps calling me. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Okay, and also if you have any questions or comments, you know what to do or inbox me if you can't get in touch with me through the comment um, thingy or whatever. So uh, that is it for the review of my installation from R&L Hair. And also you can find them on AliExpress, I forgot to say that. But yeah, so that is all and I will see you guys in my next video.